All the fermented mud crab apples you could ever want are in the baskets around the arena. Of course, you'll need this ticket to get in. And you'll have to get to them before King Boar. And you most definitely don't want to let him gulp too many down. Oh, well, they are very ripe. Pungent, uh, uh, potent, you might say. And after a few too many, that porker becomes quite puissant. A veritable stench-breathing drunken dragon. Besides, the more you keep from him, the more Jadziri can mash for you. Well, Jadziri supposes she could do something with even just one if it were particularly squishy, uh, juicy. But she will take as many as you can carry. The more the merrier, this one assures you. Oh, well, they are very ripe. Pungent, uh, uh, potent, you might say. And after a few too many, that porker becomes quite puissant. A veritable stench-breathing drunken dragon. Besides, the more you keep from him, the more Jadziri can mash for you. Well, Jadziri supposes she could do something with even just one if it were particularly squishy, uh, juicy. But she will take as many as you can carry. The more the merrier, this one assures you. Oh, well, they are very ripe. Pungent, uh, uh, potent, you might say. And after a few too many, that porker becomes quite puissant. A veritable stench-breathing drunken dragon. Besides, the more you keep from him, the more Jadziri can mash for you. Is that an invitation I smell? I soaked each one in bacon grease before sending them out. Right this way, then. I hope you brought your apron. Between the blood, saliva, and crying, well, you'll probably also need wading trousers down there. Oh, hold on, hold on. I have it written down. <clears throat> By decree of His Majesty Jester King Emmerich, the tyrannical would-be usurper, King War, is to be put to death in the arena. The porcine potentate himself. Oh, don't put on a face. It's all a gag for the festival. The conjurers call up a fan to bore for the games. You're not actually killing a big, cute, bristly piggy. This is Jester's festival, not the war in Cyrodiil. You must be fun at parties. <sighs> yes, you just go over and wrestle that giant illusory pig like an idiot while we all watch. Plus, the audience ticket sales will help finance the festival expenses for years to come. Are you in or not? By the powers vested in me, I dub thee Jester King Emmerich's Champion of Charcuterie! Now get in there and carve yourself a rasher! Oh, it's certain to be a spectacle for sure, but the only casualties have been pride. I wouldn't underestimate the conjured cob roller, or we'll be dragging you out of here with mud on your face, too. Oh, for the love of... You go punch the piggy for prizes. I don't know. Because he's the big stinky pig potentate, and Jester King Emmerich said to. What are you, the Grand Maestro of the House of Reveries? Ugh, fine. He, uh... Stole the swine princess from Jester King Yoran, and... He's... Uh... Hogging her all to himself? Yeah? I guess it does have potential. I'll keep it in mind for next year. Maybe the Jester Court will finally let me into the troop. Oh, it's certain to be a spectacle for sure. But the only casualties have been pride. I wouldn't underestimate the conjured cob roller, or we'll be dragging you out of here with mud on your face, too. Oh, for the love of... You go punch the piggy for prizes! I don't know. Because he's the big stinky pig potentate, and Jester King Emmerich said to.
The king is dead? The big oh, finale. good for them. Get me a towel! And the swine stench is just like the real thing. You smell like you just had a bath in pig sweat. And guts. And, well, you get the idea. I think the conjurers are having a laugh at your expense. Oh, right. Joy unto Tamriel. The tyrant king of pork now wallows with the dead. His haunches and horde divided among the heroic and the hungry. His head hung on high as hallmark of his hubris. Here's your cut and your cuts. They're real, I swear. Did you have any luck snatching some fermented mud crab apples out of King Vor's mouth? This should be juicy enough to start a new batch, though. Jadziri will need a few more helpers to keep her supply up. Drink up! Once you are refreshed, you'll be ready to bring this one twice as many apples, yes? Now, Jadziri has much stomping and squeezing ahead. She would talk to you as she would. Fears you would be sopping with splashed mesh before too long. See this one tomorrow, and she will have fresh. Now, Jadziri has much stomping and squeezing ahead. She would talk to you as she works, but this one fears you would be sopping with splashed mesh before too long. See this one tomorrow, and she will have fresh cider again. With happiness, love, and so, so much pent-up aggression. Jadziri sprinkles her special blend of spices onto her feet and gives the tub of overripe apples a thorough stomping. It is quite joyful. Then she sieves the slop into her still, and voila! She assures you it isn't quite so simple, but to share all her secrets would mean Jadziri's special cider would not be so... Special. Besides, it is her well-seasoned feet that give her brew its unique aftertaste. Her foot fragrance is familiar, yes?
Anything I can do for you? Care to bargain? Greetings. 